Hello fellow murderers, today is Friday, June 7th, 2024, and it's a great day to solve a murder. Today, we have Consider the Ticking Sound, and we have three 5x5 grids with suspects, locations, and weapons. Our red murder clue today is an antique clock was clearly used to commit the crime. Alright, so let's go ahead and set our how as an antique clock, and we will use our clues and evidence in our detective notebook to figure out who had the antique clock and where they were. So let's go ahead and meet today's suspects. We have Senor Emerald, Major Red, President Amaranth, Miss Ruby, and the Duchess of Vermilion. The weapons today are an antique clock, leather luggage, a bottle of wine, a myrtle board game, and an imported Italian knife. Okay, and the locations today are the locomotive, the sleeping car, the observation deck, the caboose, and the dining car. Let's go ahead and check out our clues and evidence. We're starting right off with the either or clue. Either a bottle of wine was in the dining car or an imported Italian knife was in the dining car. Okay, so I think we need to come back to these, but we can eliminate the other weapons for now. So we know it's one of these two. So either the bottle of wine or the imported knife was in the dining car. So that can also tell us, let's see, not the clock, not the luggage, and what was this one again? Oh, the Myrtle board game, of course. So it's between these two, so we can X out everything else, and we can come back to this in a little bit and see what we have there. All right, so we've got a fingerprint for the caboose. That looks like it's going to be Miss Ruby. Yeah, Duchess of Vermilion is similar, but this one's a, the swirl's a little more elevated from the bottom, and this one, the swirl's immediately on the bottom. So let's say Miss Ruby was in the caboose. Miss Ruby in the caboose. The suspect in the sleeping car was born on March 28th. Let's see, okay, that's gonna be an Aries. So let's look through. Major Red is an Aries. And Major Red is our only Aries, so we can go ahead and put Major Red in the sleeping car. A bottle of wine was not in the dining car. Oh, well, here we go. So that means that the imported Italian knife was. So we can say no and yes. And that will also tell us that neither Miss Ruby nor Major Red had the imported Italian knife because neither of them were in the dining car. Let's see, a heavyweight weapon was found in the caboose. Let's check out heavyweight, heavyweight, medium, medium, light. So either the antique clock or the leather luggage need to be in the caboose. So let's see, we can say that these three were not in the caboose because they are all heavy or they are not heavyweight and these two are our heavyweight weapons and hopefully we'll get some more information that will tell us about uh, which one was in the caboose a paper detector gave a positive reading on the duchess of vermilion this looks like the only clue that could be made of paper but let's flip through and see make sure there's nothing else yeah okay so the duchess of vermilion had the Myrtle board game. A wood detector gave a positive reading in the sleeping car. Okay, so let's look at what's made of wood. It, the antique clock. Is that it? Yeah. Okay, so this is giving us our murder and murder location. We've had it early a few times now where we don't technically need the last clue unless we want to fill out our detective's notebook, which of course we do. But for now we can say we have Major Red with the antique clock in the sleeping car. And we're able to say that because we already knew that Major Red was in the sleeping car. Um, we were looking for somebody born March 28th and that would be in Aries and Major Red was our only Aries. So Major Red was in the sleeping car. And then uh, the wood detector giving a positive reading there. That means it was the antique clock. And while we're at it, let's just go ahead and finish out the rest of our grid here. So we have the leather luggage then in the caboose. And that's going to be with Miss Ruby. 
And then Senior Emerald was seen hanging around near the heat of a steam entrance. So that's going to be the locomotive. And let's see. Okay, so we know the dagger was not in the locomotives. So that will give C Senior Emerald the uh, bottle of wine and the locomotive. And then we have uh, Duchess of Vermilion with the Myrtle board game on the observation deck, which leaves President Amaranth with the imported Italian knife in the dining car. All right, we can go back and do that one as well. All right, there's everything all filled out. Again, kind of a, a little bit of a weird one since we got the final clue earlier than the final, well, we got the final clue needed earlier than the actual final clue, but we have Major Bed with an antique clock in the sleeping car. Let's go ahead and see if we were right. All right, we were right. Thanks so much for playing along with me today. I hope this was a helpful walkthrough and we'll see you tomorrow.